So this is a quick video on using Bagcom on a Volkswagen Corrado. So first of all, click into Bagcom and go Options. So here we have uh, serial COM ports, COM 1, 2, 3 and 4. So for example, if I click on 4, it just says COM port status inaccessible. So I'll click OK. So unfortunately it won't let me work Bagcom. So make sure your cable, which is this blue one here, Make sure that's connected into the back of your computer. I'm going to go to start. Go all the way up to my computer. Right click it. Properties. Hardware. Device manager. Now we're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom here where it says ports. And when your cable is plugged in, a USB serial port will pop up. Um, before I go into that, it says COM2 there, it says COM2 there, it could say anything, it could say 1 to, I think it's like tw uh, 16, so it doesn't really matter what it says, but we want it to be 1 to 4, like we saw originally in Bagcom. So first of all, these numbers here, so it can be set at six, uh, 9600, uh, I turned it down to 4000. 800, but it could be turned down again to 2400 if it's not working for you. So click that one and into advance. So, this is what I was talking about. So, it could be in any of these. Okay, so they all go down to 31. Um, click 1 to 4, whichever one is free. And if 1 to 4 are all in use, just pull out your USB and stick it into a different USB port on your computer. And then go into all of this again and it'll uh, tell you which one now is free. So click 2 and this is the important one, put latency timer, it was at 16, turn that down to 1, then we press OK and you press OK to that, I'm, I haven't changed any settings so I'm just press cancel but you press OK, uh, close all them, back into Vicom options so com2 test yep yeah, it's happy save so you can either do auto scan so you can just type in uh, on, from the drop down menu click Corrado or we can just go back if you know exactly what you want to check so I want to check the ABS brakes because I think my little light over here for ABS is turning on All right. There we go. So ignition on. There's the lights. There's the cable. It goes into the adapter, which goes over here into these connections, which is underneath the gear stick on the Volkswagen Corrado. So next thing is ABS. Click ABS. And let it do its magic. So now it's just thinking away, trying to talk to the uh, ECU that controls ABS. It's found it. So click on false, and there's my fault. So it's a wheel speed sensor. So it's the front right, which is the driver's side here. So that's grand. So press back, and oh yeah, sorry, when you're in that, yeah, you can press uh, clear faults or clear codes. And that'll wipe everything, and then when you go for another spin, if you scan it again, if a new code comes up, it'll be saved there. It won't affect the car, it'll just tell you um, what's happening so if the car's never been scanned there could be a long list and as things get fixed it automatically writes itself but it'll keep the problem forever so you just wipe it and, and then the next time you're driving and you can scan it it'll tell you what's wrong um, also back in if none of that works this is set I think at 50 so turn down to 25 and this is set at 1 and turn it down to 0 you don't have to, but I, I do find that sometimes it helps um, Vagcom talk to the ECUs. Um, it either does or doesn't work. Sometimes it makes absolutely no difference. Um, that's it. That's how you use Vagcom to control the Corrado.